I'm Dr. Tim Chase. I'm a dentist here at Smiles NY, and I've been doing dentistry now for 29 years. I enjoy changing people's lives, both from a cosmetic sense, which is, you know, people come to us with a very specific question or need, like I want whiter teeth or I want prettier teeth. But there's another side to it, which is understanding the disease aspect of dentistry, understanding the body mouth connection, understanding how they come together. Your bite, as people would call it, plays an important role. We see many people who've been suffering with headaches, seeing chiropractors, getting Botox injections, and no one's ever taken the time to look and see how their teeth come together. Do they have what we call interferences or a bad bite? And being able to diagnose that and help them create a restful, harmonious position that's going to allow them to get some freedom in the way that their teeth come together, some harmony in the way their teeth come together, so their muscles aren't fighting each other, so that the jaw muscles can relax, so the neck muscles can relax, so the muscles in the back of the head can relax. And it's kind of amazing when you start to use the technology that we have in order to diagnose these bite issues and make sometimes really small changes can change a person's life. Top tips for finding a cosmetic dentist. Number one, how long has he been doing it? Number two, see their work. Number three, go and meet them in person and hear what they have to say. The experience that you know I've been trying to build for close to 30 years now when patients come in the door is that they understand that they're being really well cared for, but at the same time, they don't feel less than or threatened or spoken down to. Many years ago, I had a patient who was actually a local uh, doorman here in New York, and he had a lot of dental need, and he also really wanted to look his best. And as I've said before, there's, there's no judgments here, so we explained to him what all of the possibilities were. He said, all right, you know, it's a lot of money, and it's a big investment, and uh, but I'm gonna do it. Well, we laid out an overall plan, and every year after Christmas bonus time, he would come in and we would do a section of his mouth, and it took several years to get it done. But when it was finished, and we redid his entire mouth, and it was unbelievably healthy. And when it was finished, you know, nobody smiled bigger at Christmas time than he did. He was very happy. 